Hey everyone, I am Dawn Limley and I am your urban ag soil conservationist here at the Capital Conservation District and I want to share with you something I get a lot of questions about. So this is going to be your ag in a minute. Here we go. Seeds. What do you do with seeds? You, you got seeds in the mail from us or you saw them in the store. What do you do with them now? Here we go. So on the front, obviously, you're going to be able to tell what you're planting. At the top, you're going to see what variety. In this case, it's a carrot and we are planting little finger carrots. That's important. Flip that bad boy over, and on the back of it is lots of other really useful information. So one thing you're going to look for is maturity. How many days to maturity before I'm going to have carrots that I can harvest? In this case, it's 65. So the other thing you're going to look at is sowing. How far apart do these carrots need to be planted in the ground? Can I plant them really close together? Can I plant them far apart? Can I plant them, you know, really shallow in the soil? Do they need to go deeper in the soil? That's really important information. So that's all going to be located here on the back. Germination rate. How long is it going to be before I'm going to see those tiny little sprouts sprouting? That's the fun part. So how many days is it going to be before I'm going to start to see those seeds germinate? On the bottom, this particular one is stamped at the bottom. Sometimes on the side you're going to see a date stamp. That date's really important. It's going to tell you when these seeds were packaged. In this case, they were packaged for 2020. Does that mean that I can only plant them in 2020? No, it doesn't. What that means is that they were packaged for 2020 and they're freshest in 2020. If you want to share them, if you want to save them, you can still plant these for three or four more years after that. You may not get as many seeds to germinate, but they will still be good. Sometimes you'll see on the back of another seed packets. This is a different brand. These are radishes. And so sometimes you'll see a map on the back. This is going to be a color-coded map usually that tells you what zone you're in. A lot of times it's going to tell you when to plant your seeds. If you are to plant them in May or June or maybe in uh, March or April, it's going to tell you when to plant those seeds based on the zone that you live in. And a lot of them have a little chart across the back that gives you all of that other information about spacing and seed depth and germination and maturity. So those are all wonderful things you need to look for. They're all really useful information, all included right on the back of your seed packet. I hope this was helpful. Your ag in a minute. If you have any questions or comments, just drop them in the comments below and I'll be sure to try and answer them for you.